All right. We are recording on both cameras. Let's see how this works. Haven't done this one before. So we are going to take a quick little ride. This should be about five minutes, maybe 10, down Brown Station Road in Upper Marlboro, Maryland. Um, if you guys are from the area, you may know where we're at. And we are recording video on both the Samsung AO2 and we're using the front camera, so that's just a 5 mega megapixel camera. It's not going to look all that great. Listen to me. Once upon a time, I'd have loved to have a 5 mega megapixel camera. Um, and I still do love to have it. But, um, yeah. Uh, I think I'm shooting in 1080. I um, hope I'm shooting in 1080 on this, this front camera. It is 35 frames per second. The shutter is set at 160. The ISO is set at 400. And the white balance, I don't know what the Kelvins are, but it is set for cloudy. And it's almost nighttime. It's getting dark. But, um, you know, just enough to get me. I basically just wanted some B-roll of me riding with the helmet on. Get all up in there. Good B-roll. Good B-roll. B, the B, the B, the B, B-roll. And, um... You know, nothing serious. We just out riding. Um... You do get a good shot of me, what it looks like with the camera on the side of the helmet. I'm not one of those people who wears their helmet up under their chin, although I've been considering making that change. Um, I like the camera over here on the right side, and I know that's not the most picture-perfect shot for you guys, but, you know, I don't really consider myself to be like a perfectionist when it comes to moto vlog picture quality so mm, I don't really want to ride around with a camera on my chin I'm definitely not gonna try to put it on top of the helmet I don't like yeah that looks that looks crazy to me um, I think the footage looks pretty decent coming off the side of the camera all things considering um, I don't know what this looks like if I do stand up. Uh, doesn't look good. But, um, yeah, so I don't know. Maybe I'll use some of this as B-roll in the other videos I made. Um, before this video. This is my third video out on this day out. Third motovlog video, I should say, because I made, um, mm, two or three videos for the other channel this morning. I've been quite a while editing them, so I don't know if I'll be able to get these edited tonight. I might. My mind is, like, fried today. Kind of feel. I'm usually like this on on a fri on a Friday after a busy week at work. That's how I feel today. Um, it could be, yeah. This is that keto brain they be talking about. Because I really cut back hard on the carbs beginning yesterday. I mean, I've had you know yesterday I had a few carbs, but nothing close to my norm. When I say norm, I mean what I've been doing the last few months. I've just been terrible the last several months. And I'm trying to get back on track. Yeah, you get it. New Year's resolution thing, blah, 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 blah. But I've actually been doing a little better the last few weeks, even prior to, you know, kind of preparing for. But I'm definitely, <coughs> I've cut back hard on carbs. And I think that's partly why I'm feeling the way I feel. I'm glad that, kind of glad it's supposed to snow tonight and tomorrow. They're calling for three to seven inches, which, you know, ain't terrible. 
but you know it's probably going to be enough snow and ice and coldness this week that I probably won't get out on the bike again um, this week I might but I doubt it um, so I definitely wanted to take it out I mean we're going it's January uh, I didn't I haven't been riding much in December which usually I do ride quite a bit in December and January February are always really iffy you know it really just depends on the weather um, and not so much the coldness I mean yeah it can be too cold to ride sometimes but more so you know I can ride in the rain I can ride in the cold I don't ride in the cold rain so I don't know what the weather has in store for us for the next two or three months but I'll get my riding in where I can I'm not one of those people who winterizes their bike and especially because so much of my riding is actually riding on city streets and um, they're usually you know the streets are clean um, relatively speaking they're well maintained I've had people comment on that the roads that we ride on here you know in, in Maryland whether it's Prince George's County one of the other counties Charles County St. Mary's County Montgomery County Anne Arundel County Carroll County Frederick County Baltimore County whatever you know well-kept roads But a lot of my video was actually shot in the city in Washington, D.C. And, you know, relative to the other parts of the world, those roads are pretty decent as well. Although, sometimes D.C. gets into this little pothole phase that'll drive you crazy if you're riding in a car. You don't mind it riding on an ADV bike. And it's all relative. Some other parts of the country here in the U.S., the roads are better kept. But I know for a lot of folks in some other parts of the world, um, there's a lot more gravel riding, dirt riding. Streets aren't as well maintained sometimes. And the bikes aren't always as big. You know, they're not riding these big ADV bikes. 21 inch front wheels and stuff like that so that can make a difference okay so we did open the engine up for a split second just to get it get the blood flowing on the bike okay I know the bike doesn't have blood it has oil keep the oil flowing on the bike And I don't know, I guess I've been riding for about 45 minutes. That was enough to warm up the tires, enough to warm up the engine. And I guess I could park it for another week if I need to. I'll tell you one thing, I was glad it started right up. I was a little getting a little worried about the battery. I don't think I've started this, well, I know I haven't started the bike in two weeks, that I know. Um, if I think real hard, I'll remember the last time I rode the bike. It was, it was a commute to work. And it was December, I think. Because I, yeah, I've rode the bike since then. Anyway, rock and roll, over and out.